If you told me two years ago that I would drop out of college twice, I would move to the other side of Europe to build an upgrade mobile gym, I would probably ask, what the hell are you on, man? Many people settle to live a passive life without ever reflecting on themselves or their values and they end up living in mediocrity until they realize how fast life is passing by. It's like driving a car without grabbing a steering wheel or having sex without a condom. When it comes down to creating a life of intention and purpose, it really comes down to getting to know yourself. So what are your values? If money wasn't a problem, what would I do? When have I been the happiest? What was your dream when you were a kid? Write a list, put everything in there. Don't overthink this, just put everything in that you enjoy doing or you are good at. All this is only to set you off in a direction. If I have learned something is that you will never know where you will end up. But you have to keep moving, you have to have a direction that aligns with you. In my case, I realized I didn't want anything material. I wanted simplicity. I valued time over money, because I tried the 9 to 5 and money without time really had no meaning. I found visualization played a crucial role for me. Through meditation and journaling, I could manifest my dreams and the first action would to get them on paper. The last two years have been the most rewarding, frustrating and meaningful years in my entire life. But I grew more in two years than I did the rest of my life. So I hope that's enough to set a fire under your ass. If I consume less, then I need less. That was one of the biggest realizations I had living this lifestyle. And what we don't understand is actually how much our career or business is correlated to our personal development. If you spend time connecting with yourself and becoming a more realized human being, you will see a direct correlation with success in basically everything you do in your life. So the biggest takeaway from this video I want you to have is to learn how to learn. Learn how to be a student, learn how to be a beginner, learn to ask the right questions to yourself. It's really important to know that it's a never-ending journey. Getting to know yourself will never get old, right? And here comes my next point which is how to set goals and work for them the smart way. So the goals I want you to set for yourself, I want them to be specific. So let's say that your goal was to get biceps like Matt Diavel. <laughs> That's specific enough. Next is measurable, meaning how will you know you achieved your goal? What is your intended outcome? Attainable, meaning what actions will you put in place to ensure you achieve this goal? Relevant. Why is it important for you to achieve this goal? And you want them to be time-based. Meaning, what is the timeline you have for achieving this goal? Achievable, realistic, and the most important of all is to time them, to have a deadline. I'm a big believer of showing up. I believe it's much more powerful than quitting just because there's too high standards or you didn't meet the expectation you had. My perfectionism, my emotional intelligence, the standards and the expectations have always been getting in the way of finishing things I start my whole life. If I zoom out just for a second, life is basically a bunch of failures. Every day we realize stuff, we learn new things, we set goals and try to get better physical or mentally. So it really all comes down to how you see failure. The definition of failure I like to have in mind is that failure is like a good friend showing you the way when you don't know what's next. He pushes you away from him when realizing something is not for you and train you to be alert and strong to continue as he equip you with more knowledge about yourself for the future. Through this whole process you will, you will get overwhelmed many times, you will f lose your direction but things take time and all of this is just a journey that you had to learn to enjoy day by day. Your life is basically days repeated after days and your day is repeated moments after moments. So if you learn to know what you want 
and learn to implement that in your daily life and repeat that process, it's basically a very practical way of creating a lifestyle that you can own. Thank you so much guys for watching. I really appreciate you all for being here. Please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And the most important of all, if I can ask you to do one thing only, it will be to please hit the bell icon so you don't miss out the future videos. And because we're human beings and we need to socialize, I would really love to socialize with you down in the comment section. Please let me know what you have at heart or what you would like me to make in future videos. See you guys, enjoy your life and make it the best. Your life is your craft, so master it.